Hello my loves and welcome to today's Gymshark summer, spring summer haul. I have a lot of pairs of shorts, um, but I do have a few pairs of leggings in there as well because it's nice to mix it up, isn't it? Um, I have got a mixer of colours actually. I had some intention of trying to add some, inject some colour into my workout wardrobe as it is typically very black and quite classic. And I do like it like that because it means you don't really get bored, but sometimes you think, Oh God, I'm such a boring bitch. <laughs> I need to have a bit more colour. Um, or I have some nice coloured things that I don't really have other things to go with. So that was the intention really behind today's order. So I've got lots of pieces to get through, so let's just get started. Um, I'm actually going to start about what I'm wearing now. So I picked up this um, black, it's like finely ribbed. Um, very, very finely ribbed. I hope it's coming up on the camera. Um, really, re yes, it is really, really lovely, tight, um, supportive, and also quite uplifting um, sports bra. It's quite small at the back. It looks a little bit bikini-esque, but I feel like I'm just on my way to Bali. When you guys watch this, I think I will actually be in Bali. Will I? maybe so yeah i'm gonna be there for two months and i'm stupidly excited about it so if you guys aren't already subscribed make sure to hit subscribe because i will be doing some vlogs and bali content and travel content as well as the fashion so yeah make sure you are here for it all um, and make sure you're also following over on instagram because i'll do daily stuff up there on my stories and also my reels um but yeah, I was thinking about like working out in the heat, hence the, the shorts, um, quite a few pairs of shorts in the haul. But this is actually really lovely and a really classic black top. I don't actually have a great classic bra. The only thing I would worry about a little bit is if I'm jumping around, they might start to come out a little bit. It does feel quite like, but at the same time, it is quite low cut, isn't it? So maybe this is a bit more of like a Pilates, yoga, sports bra kind of thing. If you are new here, hello, hi, I'm Katie. And I am a UK size 12 and five foot nine for reference. And I think I picked everything up today in a medium, which is what I normally wear in Gymshark. Um, I do find some of the fits a bit different on some of the styles. So we'll talk about that. And I'll also mention the pricing and leave all the links down below for you guys to be able to shop it super easily after um, you finish watching. Also, some of the pieces that I did order haven't arrived because this has actually happened three times. The Gymshark parcel just never came. So I had to actually contact them and be like, where's my parcel? This is the third time it's not arrived when I've done a big order. I think the every man is having a great time with Gymshark clothes. <laughs> so they had to resend and then Obviously, if some of the things have gone out of stock, so if something doesn't match too well, it's not me just having really bad taste, it's that I did actually order other things to go with it, but I didn't want to hinder the fact that we were going to have the haul today. So yeah, there's a few things that are actually missing, which is a shame, um, but I'm just trying to find the price of... Oh, the chocolate brown stuff didn't come. I really wanted the brown stuff. So yeah, this is the apparently rest day. So this is going to be like for around the house loungewear. I can see why they would think of it like that. It is really lovely. It's £30. Uh, rest day seamless bralette in black. Um, and then I will show you these shorts that I've got on as well. So these are some cycling shorts, like a cameo print. Um, these are the Gymshark Adapt Animal Seamless Cycling Shorts in Reef Black. Um, so they have like this cool like cameo print recently didn't like it but i do like it um it kind of gives it like a gray color and they have like that scrunch bum detail um and they are squat pro but i do feel like this looks a little like the bum bit looks a little bit like a pull in the bum like it doesn't really i don't think it enhances my bottom as it should i think it just um looks a little bit like a pull on the bum which is weird however they are quite sculpting they are quite pulling me in um, they're not pushing too much out which is always a plus when you're wearing pull me -ins. um but yeah I do like them they're very very long which is great if you know you really want this part of your leg covered but for me I probably would prefer a short to finish here I don't like them when they're super short and I don't like them kind of when they're this long I guess if you're a cyclist <laughs> this would be great but anyway, let's move swiftly on. For those who are going to be 
here all day because there's a lot to get through. Okay, I'm gonna move on to this because I'm I'm really not sure about this and I wanna try it on to see what I think. So it's got this like geometric style stripe print, but it's, I don't know. What do you guys think about this? Let me pop it on and we'll see what we think. Okay, so I'm still unsure. <laughs> I like how it looks together, like the set. The shorts are where I just said I would prefer a short to land and be. So I definitely prefer the length on the shorts. They just finish just a little bit higher. They're not all the way down to there. I do actually think they're a little bit more flattering. Don't know why. Um, what do you think? Yay or nay? Leave me a comment on the, we'll call it the sand set. Um, yes, I do like it. I'm gonna go with yes. It's just a bit different. It's just a bit different. I don't think, you know how sometimes when you wear lighter colors, you see the sweat through really bad. I actually don't think you'd get a bad sweat patches with this because it's got like the tonal colors. It already has those like darker tones of shadows. I think this is lush. Okay, I'm gonna go with yay. I like it. I just wanna go back a little bit further so you can see the shorts properly. And I could have just tilted you down. <laughs> I didn't think. But yeah, no, I do really like this. I think it's lovely. It looks a little bit like a unitard when it's in in one but it's a nice length as well like there's not too much belly out it's high enough but they're not like right up under my boobs this is long enough because sometimes i feel like when they sit here it can be a little bit unflattering like when you're working out i mean skin folds skin rolls it is normal it's completely normal but if we can flatten it and smooth it i'm definitely here for that so yeah i think this is gonna be my favorite set of the haul i could just tell her i do i'm going with yay Got a medium in both. Just want to show you the back of the sports bra. That's really pretty. Oh, I really like that. It's a yay from me. But I want to know if it's a yay from you guys or not. Um, I might move on to a little bit of colour now. So, I did pick up, not intentionally to go together, but like I said, things have not arrived. So we're going to go with this little pastel toned combo. But I do want to just try this over the sports bra because it's not a kind of, um, you know, you're going to have to wear a sports bra under it because it's a little bit see-through. So I'm going to try it over this and then we'll swap the shorts and we'll see how we get on. Oh, I didn't tell you the price. So the shorts I'm wearing are 45. A little bit spent. It's a little bit spent. And then the top is 40. So that 85 for the set it's quite pricey isn't it gymshark used to be the more well priced brand but that is definitely on the higher end of my budget <laughs> okay i feel a little bit like some pastel colored princess <laughs> i really don't feel super comfortable in color if i wear color i try to go pastel because it doesn't make me feel as ick but I'm not loving this. I thought I would love this top. I thought there's nothing I can't like about it. This is my favorite color, but I don't like anything about it. I don't like how it looks. I don't like how it makes my boobs look. I don't like the line down the middle. I feel like it's quite manly and masculine. I feel like, oh, in it, even though it's pink. Um, I do like the back, but I'd love it if it had, I'd love it if these, these kind of tops had like a little subtle thing in so you didn't have to wear a big sports bra underneath. Like it just feel like, takes away from how nice the top is because if that was just like open back and it had some support here it'd be lovely um however i do think these are fab but they're very similar to a pair that i already do have the ones i do have are a little bit longer unfortunately the style i don't particularly love um but these are really lovely i do find the v style very flattering as women we have slightly more protruding bellies here it's very very normal it's not just you it's quite normal not everyone has it, but a majority of women have this, obviously, because one day we go and give birth to babies. Um, so it's that's like literally why we have it, and it protects all the organs inside here. Obviously, I've got a little bit of extra fat in there as well. I'm not completely delusional, but that is the case, just to <laughs> let you guys know. Um, so yeah, I do think the V is really, really flattering. And actually, as far as like a plain color and a lighter color go, they are fairly flattering. Yes, they are squat proof, which is fab. Um, so for me, it's the top of the knee, and I already do have a pair very similar to these, so I won't be picking them up. And the bottoms are 32, so a little bit more 
you know, I think acceptably priced than the other ones. And the top is 28, and I'm pretty sure this was in the sale. I'm a bit, I'm a bit gutted I don't love this top because it would have been fab. I've been looking for just like a nice cute pink workout top and the length on this is also great. But yeah, I don't know why, I just don't love how it's looking on me. Let's go with this maroony set. Now, I gotta be honest, I'm not super keen. I think it's gonna look better on. It's, I think it's like part of the Vital Seamless range maybe. Um, I don't love the print on this. I don't love it, don't like it, don't love it. I have this like, it's kind of brownie so I can get along on board with it, but it's also like a bit maroony, reddy, purpley. That's not really my vibe or colour. I've got a long sleeve top to go with it. And I also picked up the, they're not the cycling shorts, they're like the slightly shorter short. So good length on the short. I do actually like the shorts, they look really nice. And nice alternative to black, because like I mentioned earlier, sometimes when you wear light colours, like with these blue ones, you'll definitely see the sweat patches. So I probably would end up keeping these more for like yoga, walks, you know, outdoor wear. So let's try this little three piece on. So, as I suspected, it does look a little bit nicer on than I thought. Definitely looks better on than off, like on the hanger, I was a bit like, Ugh. but off, I really like it. <laughs> I feel like, I said, when I say off, I mean off the hanger, obviously, on me. Um, yeah, I really like it. I do really like it. I like the shorts, they've got pockets. I really like that. They're really soft, they're quite flattering. The length on them is perfection. They are pulling them, but not too much that I'm not breathing or anything's being pushed out. They don't feel like they would fall down, which is great. They are squat proof, which is great. I like this as a set. It just comes across like kind of like a chocolate brown. I don't love the double sports bra. Like I don't really get it. Like it literally is double. Um, I'll show you the back as well. The detail on the back is cute though. That actually is really nice. I do like that. But um, I don't know if I keep it or not. Let's try this um, long sleeve top on. You guys can leave me a comment about the chocolate set. Yay or nay? Do we keep it? Do we not? Do we like it? Do we not? Oh, this is more me now. I love, I love me a long sleeve top. I just find them really like, they're classy, but they're still a bit sexy. Um, and there's no skin out with this one. Oh, I like this as a set. You guys need to let me know though, yes or no to the chocolate set. What do you guys think? <sighs> but yes, when I come up close up this, I don't like it. I don't like the red fleck in it. No. Oh, that's such a shame because from far away, if it was just chocolate brown, I actually think I'd be obsessed. Now, I thought these were like more of a, I say forest green, but I guess they are. They're like quite an olivey green. I really like how they've done the really subtle branding on these and they look very much like, you know, the seamless Lulu's kind of vibe, Butterlux. Um, they definitely go for that kind of vibe with them. So we'll try these on. I think I'll try these on with um, this sports bra, which is exactly what I've got right now, but in black, much more <laughs> my thing. It's got like black with a gray fleck through it. So let's try that and see how we get on. Okay. This is quite like, whew, again, <laughs> lifts them up. But I don't like how it's sitting again. I feel like it could have been, like that would have been really nice if it just had the one. I'm not loving it with the inside bra. I don't get it. It's like, maybe it is giving you double support though. Maybe that's what it is and I just don't really need that level of support. Now the trousers, they look, they look better on. When I look down at them, I'm like, whoa, they're really green. Like super green. Um, I think they're quite flattering. Let me go all the way back for you guys to see full length. So here is full length of the trousers. I don't know. I think they're very flattering. They feel, again, like quite sculpting, quite pulling me in, smoothing me out, that kind of thing. What I do notice with quite a lot of these um, plain coloured ones is they sometimes have like these weird, almost like dye colour lines through. I don't know if it's going to come up on the camera, but I can see it like super clearly here. And I had it in a pair of khaki trousers before, exactly the same. I just think it's a bit weird. And especially when you're paying quite a bit of money for, you know, 
gym wear. I don't feel like that should be the issue. But I just realised as well I didn't tell you the price of that. So the chocolate brown shorts. Ooh. <laughs> I might be keeping these now. £30 sold. I'm sold. That to me is great quality, great value for money. Sold. I also think they'd look cute with the cream sports bra as well, the sandy coloured one. The sports bra, this one is £38 and it's called the Gymshark Adapt Fleck Seamless Sports Bra. Um, and then the other one that I just had on was the chocolate brown colour. That oh, makes sense why I ordered them. Um, and then the top is the Adapt Fleck Seamless Long Sleeve Crop Top. And that one was £38. So the sports bra is £38. Sports... Okay, so I did order, but it hasn't arrived, the olive top to match, which as you can see is gorge. Um, it was £40, but it hasn't arrived. And these are 42 I actually think that's all right for the quality of them. The quality is really, really high on these, um, bar slight discoloration that I mentioned. I think I'll try this on as we, I'm just, you know, why not? I picked up this zip me up because I haven't bought one of these in ages. I have three and I have a pink one, a khaki one and a black, plain black one. And to be honest, the quality, they are all from Amazon and they, they're like the Lululemon dupes. And the quality of them is incredible. They've lasted so well um, that I have had them for so many years and never ever had to replace them. My pink one, however, has slightly just, the, the color of it's got like a little bit washed out, but I probably had the pink one first. So I maybe had that for like five years. And I was like, right, it's time to buy a new one. <laughs> and I think this is it because this is stunning. Oh my God, I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. This is lush. This is literally lush. The quality is insane. The thickness is insane. I always love a little thumb hole. Although I don't think they look great. I just feel like I like them. I like to feel like mm, cozy, you know? And this is flattering, cozy, soft. It's really soft. It feels quite warm. Um, oh, I love this. I love how this is fitting. Let me guys, uh, let me know what you think about this. I do actually quite like it with the green pants as well. I know I'm American, but yeah, I do like this. I think this is gonna be a keep, very much so. I mean, I think this might be a little bit of like an, an overload of the print, but I have actually got matching trousers. Do I have matching shorts as well? Oh no, they're slightly different. I do have some like slightly different shorts to try on as well. So let me just pop these on and see what they look like. Obviously it's gonna be a bit of a overload and I probably wouldn't wear them together, but I wanna see what the quality of these is like because it does look really nice. Um, they've got that like scrunchy bum detail again. Um, and yeah, let's try them on and see. Oh my God, these give you such good shape. These are shaping. Wow. I did think I liked them because I knew I liked the material. For me, clothes is so much about the material, how it sits on your body, the fit, the cut. They nailed this. Nailed it, but it's just fine. Sometimes it's finding ones that like just fit and suit your body shape. This is a bit of a set, isn't it? I don't know if it's not too much, you know, because it is black. Is it too much to wear it together, like as a combo? They're actually a really nice length on the leg as well. I like it when they're just above my ankle and they just are. If you want like one really lush gym set and you're trying to get a good, you know, like he's trying to build a new gym wardrobe. I feel like this could be the set because it's so classic, so gorgeous, but so like, it's a little bit more exciting than just being just plain boring black. Yes, I'm here for this. I really love this. Really, really, really. Let me know down below. Leave me a comment and tell me if you love the black three-piece with this print. I don't really know what the print is. So it's called the Gymshark Adapt Animal Zip Through Wild Slash Black. That's me really, isn't it? Like black is like classic, but then I'm a little bit wild too. So I love it. This is 44 pound. But like I said, these kind of things, cause you just put them on and off normally, unless you maybe go running in them. They're, they last forever. Forever, ever, forever, ever, forever, ever. So yeah, here for that. And the leggings are 35. Stop it. Are they? That's all. 
I'm sold on them too. 35. Oh my God, I love it when that happens. I love it when you're like, oh, they're gonna be like 50 quid. And then you check and they're way less. You're like, thank you universe. So yeah, absolutely sold on those. I've got a few more bits to get through. Um, oh, I've got this cute little croppy top. Let's try this on. Because I think this is gonna look cute um, for like yoga, Pilates, because now I do both of those things. I, I, I used to teach yoga, so I love yoga. But I have now started doing Pilates. I was someone who was like, I don't get Pilates, I don't like Pilates, it's not for me. <laughs> and now I'm like, okay, yeah, I do Pilates. <laughs> it's really freaking hard, mind. But um, I do, I do actually really enjoy the challenge of it. That's what I like. So this I think will be lovely for that because it's a really nice thin material. Um, it's nice, a little bit more covered. Uh, I don't know if you can see how. Thin yeah, like a thin, it looks almost like tights, but you can't see through it when it's on because I actually put it on earlier without anything underneath and you couldn't see any boob. So it is actually supportive enough that you could wear it without something underneath. However, this is the back and how it looks. I actually think it's really cute. Um, I like this as a set as well because there's not even any belly out now. We've got a really good height on these, um, but again, like not too high. And then this comes down just touching it. I find like this is the most flattering because it really shows the waist. Sometimes if you wear something baggier down here, like just you just look like you're this whole same width all the way up, like this, rather than like, you know, this is clearly giving me shape. Like I'm gonna go to a ballet class. But I'm okay with that, because I did used to do ballet, believe it or not, from that awful uh, demonstration. Um, so this is the Elevate three quarter sleeve crop top. This is forty pound. Ooh, <laughs> ooh. Now see, I'm thinking this was this should. For me, I think this would have been twenty five pound. Forty pound? No, not sold on that. Forty pound? I don't think. No, I'm not. Okay, I'm already like absolutely not to this sports bra. And absolutely not to these. They did make a few crunches when I just tried to pull them on. A little bit worrying. Um, I picked up this because I've got a really nice pair of lilac trousers and I wanted something like with a print to go with them so they've got like this um <sighs> it's got a I don't really know what print this is leopard print kind of very subtle small miniature leopard print I don't hate it but I don't love it either and I want to love it um I don't like the back either I think it's a little bit naff scrunch bum shorts on I'm not I don't love these scrunch bums to be fair, it makes my butt look great, actually. <laughs> actually, I can see, I get the hype now. <laughs> I do get that hype because that makes it look way better, but it's not really what my bum looks like. And this is not a good look, though. This is not very flattering. Um, they're a little bit too short. I can feel them like they're rising, they're sliding. I'd be like this halfway through the workout, and this is not a good look. So let's just get them straight off. Um, I will tell you the price on them now and then we will, I'll get into my next things. I literally just wanna get out of it. Oh, wait, they did put that top in. Oh, cute, okay, great. Um, yes, I just need to get out of this outfit and you'll probably hear a few more crunches when I take it off. <sighs> okay, so we've got the other end of the scale now. This is a medium top and it's huge, so there's like absolutely, like how much it moves, because it's just it's just so big. I could have size like E boobs and it would probably only just then fit me, uh, which is a shame because quite cute with the little V, quite cute, just plain, long sleeved, classy, but this would be a nice little Pilates outfit. I do like it, it's just a little bit big and not fitting super well, and like I said earlier, when I have to, I have to, like the fit for me has to be spot on, otherwise I just don't keep things, because I don't think it's worth it. You don't feel your best in it, it's not, it's not worth it. My favorite thing to do, and this is honestly how I found my style, how I find what suits me, is you just order everything, try it all on, and you only keep the stuff that is like, boom, send it all back. I don't get it when people are like, oh, I don't know, should I order it, shouldn't I order it? I'm like, order it, try it. If you don't like it, you can send it back and you get a full refund, like, and then you can stop thinking about it and you can move on with your life. You know some people that like, did their and there about things for like months, they're like, oh, shall I get it, shall I get it? Just get it, put it on a credit card, put it on Klarna. 
and then return it if you don't like it and you haven't had to lose any money. I just don't, <laughs> I just, do you know what I mean? <laughs> right, anyway, moving, moving swiftly on, the lilac top was in the sale. Um, it was the Adapt Animal Seamless Crop Tank in Reef Soft Lilac, £26. And the Sage Shorts were the Power Original Tight Shorts, bloody other were tight, £35. Um, so just to show you guys the, the difference between the blue and the green, as you can see there, just the blue is slightly longer and these are actually meant to be shorter and slightly more clingy. Uh, the top that I've got on now is £30, which I think is spot on for price. I definitely think, boom, they got that one right. Um, and the shorts, which I haven't even talked to you guys about yet, are the Elevate Cycling Shorts, and they're £36. I think, mm, I think these are probably like more 30, 35 push. Um, just because they're very plain, they're very simple, quite boring, not very much going on, but they do do what they say. Um, they're quite flattering, quite soft. Again, that more like Butterlux, Yululu style. Very, very just like lovely and soft. Very subtle branding. I always like a subtle brand. Because sometimes you just, sometimes you get bored of a brand. You know, like, I don't really want your logo all, all over the place. And the other logo is here on the back, off the top. But Gymshark does have to have the logo everywhere, doesn't it? Um, there's a few more brands that I have tried recently of gym clothes. I did do a Adenola haul. So if you guys are wondering what they are like, pop and see my little mini haul slash review because I was really wondering what it's gonna be like, what the quality is gonna be like. And I'm not gonna give anything away, but yes, definitely go and watch that. I'll leave a link underneath for you guys. Um, I've got to pop these little other pair of biker shorts on now, which do look really cute. And then I've got a really sweet white pair just to finish. Okay, these have, they're quite clingy, but like not in a good way, I wouldn't say. I don't know. I'm finding like sometimes things that are clingy can like, like I mentioned, pull you in, then push you out in other areas. And I feel like they are doing that thing where they, they kind of push the underskin out. They don't have scrunchy bum, but they do have a, a line there because I can feel it. Um, I didn't do a squat test on the blue ones, did I? I don't think these are squat proof, are they? they might not be. They might not be squat proof, these ones. Um, and they are a little bit too short. Yeah, I can feel them like poking in there, my thigh poking out, because as soon as I start moving, I can feel them riding up my legs a little bit, and I'll be like this, putting them down all class, and you just, you just don't want that. However, this is a combo does look kind of cute. <laughs> What do you think? I do actually think this looks really cute as a combo. Very nice. Very nice. Um, I will come in so you can see the print a little bit better. Um, they are quite cute, but I do feel like they're kind of emphasising this rather than pulling anything in or shaping it in a way that, that I would like. So, yes, we shall move on to the last pair of shorts, which I didn't really remember picking up. I feel like the model must have sold these to me because they're not really something I would normally pick up. Don't really know why I picked them up. And I don't really like them. I don't like the cut. They feel like I've got a big white nappy on. <laughs> That's not the look we're going for, is it? Got my nappy pants on. Oh my God, you can tell it's late. It's actually, when I'm filming this, it's 9.30 p.m. on a, what day is it? Monday, Monday night. Who is crazy enough to film a YouTube video at 9.30 on a Monday night? Someone who's not in the country on a Wednesday. That's who. I've got to get it done. But yeah. <laughs> Absolute eh -eh from me. That's probably what sold them to me. £10. They were £10. I mean, to be fair, no I know that. They're great quality for £10. I just think they look like a nappy. I don't like the, the cut of them at all, which is a shame. They do actually look good on the model, so, you know, maybe that's just what you need to look like. So I did actually pick some bits up for Reese as well, but they were also fails, so not really anything worth mentioning. Um, but if you guys do pick anything up, let me know what you do. And if you did love anything, I'd love to hear from you, so let me know in the comments. If you're like, oh my God, Katie, that's rank. 
tell me in the comments because I just, like I say, I love to hear from you guys. Feedback is super important and anything you guys want to see on the channel moving forward, if you want some Bali vlogs or maybe you want a Bali guide um, or just like what I'm up to, what I'm wearing, uh, anything like that really, just let me know because you guys asked for a new look vlog last week, uh, sorry, a new look haul and that's what we had last week and I think you guys did enjoy it. So when you guys ask, I will make. So <laughs> please let me know down below in the comments um, and thank you all so much for being here. Next time I see you, I will be in Bali. So um, very excited for that trip and I shall see you very soon. Make sure you're following all, all my other channels. My name is exactly the same as it is on here and I hope to see you in the next video. Make sure you subscribe, click the button on, not to miss videos um, as I upload every single week.